Hi, I'm Neil Walters, I'm Chairman of the National Federation of Builders. I first got in touch with the college probably about six years ago at an in-business event which uh, was organised by Steve Duras. And this was where the college are trying to bring local business together with uh, the college uh, to talk about uh, academia and, and how we can help uh, uh, young people. And as president of the Birmingham Association I had access to quite a bit of funding and I thought it would be a great idea to try and channel some of that funding into the college. Well, some of our students suffer hardship so it enables them to experience a, a work placement so that they can practice the skills that they've, they've been taught in college here in a real work setting. We've got over 500 beneficiaries of the scheme. The money from NFB has been used to support learners either into work placements in some cases into apprenticeships or into scholarships and has been a fabulous way of supporting learners for the last four or five years. As Neil had said earlier, we met at a networking event at Construction Campus uh, about six years ago and that's how really in business works. We connect with businesses and organisations to make a difference to our young people. Um, I got all my hand tools together. Like, I went to work, they just told me everything I needed, hand tool wise, hand saw, all the other bits, and that just got me set. Of course with travel, because I have to travel from place to places. It allowed me to put petrol and stuff in the car and get to work, and that helped me enormously at the start, because obviously I didn't have a lot of money around me at the time. It would have took me at least, would have took me at least four months to gather, gather the tools together. I would have been slower starting, wouldn't have you know, progressed as quick as I did. It's just nice to have some youth and um, energy into the company really because obviously most of the guys we have are all sort of fully qualified, been around the block um, and they sort of, they just offer, offer a bit of enthusiasm. They're extremely good. We, we work together and communicate 110% to get the students on board. We get to see the new crop coming through and gives us the opportunity to assess how well they're doing and it gives our subcontract uh, base a good uh, feeling of what's available and how good they are to take on. At first I was kind of surprised because it's just something that I do because I like it and I never really think that I'd get any recognition for it but it just I'm very appreciative that if I did get it. I hope that uh, when they become uh, employees in their own right, because a lot of these young people will go into form their own businesses, that they'll remember the help the NFB gave them in their early years, and maybe join the NFB as uh, member companies in years to come. I'm really proud and pleased that the NFB have decided to work with us. At the moment we're working with the Westmoreland's Combined Authority, and there's no question there's a real uh, tsunami of uh, construction jobs coming through, and there will be a massive requirement for training over the next few years. We aim to be working with the NFB and uh, other organisations to make sure we are supporting that and that we have people in place uh, within our local economy. I'd like to say thank you for the funding. It makes it easier for us to you know, um, get this work experience as I've done. And I really appreciate it. Yeah. <laughs>